What's up productive people? It's Connor from BusyBox. And in this video, we're gonna go over how to reset your BusyBox software, firmware, Bluetooth list, and do a factory reset. Should you need technical support, our team might ask you to try one of these to reset the product. While we strive to make every BusyBox perfect out of the box, Sometimes a tricky unit makes its way past our QC team. Often a reset can get things back and running. Also, if you're preparing to sell your busy box, it's best to clear all of the connections. Follow these steps to accomplish different levels of reset. Quick little pro tip, it might be easier to hold down the buttons if the cover is off. The first level of resets is to simply power down and restart the unit. Press and hold either side button until the battery status LED turns off. Now press the side button again to start the unit. The second level is the computer reset. To reset the computer, turn the unit over and remove the mount. Through the right mount hole, you'll find a button labeled reset. Press and release the button using the end of a pen or pencil, and the BusyBox will turn off its internal computer and restart the system. All right, the third level is the factory reset. This is best used for selling the unit. It wipes out all of the memory in the BusyBox, including your save presets. To accomplish this, flip the BusyBox over and remove the cover. On the right, find the reset button located inside of the right mount hole. Now press on the left button and hold it. While holding the left button, press and release the reset button and keep holding the left button. After about 10 seconds, the unit will restart. From here, you'll need to reconnect to your app like you did when you first got the unit. All right, this is the Bluetooth reset. Someday you might want to clear all the devices that can connect to your BusyBox. And you can do so by holding down both left and right buttons. While holding down the buttons, your device will start blinking blue. Keep holding down the side buttons until your BusyBox returns back to a solid color. Quick little note, when you're holding down the side buttons, the BusyBox on the device screen will turn gray. Keep holding down the side buttons until the device turns to a solid color. Once your device turns back on, the BusyBox in the app's device page will show a yellow warning triangle. At this point, you can either delete the device from the app and restart the pairing process, or click on the triangle and start the pairing process over. Either way, your Bluetooth connection will reset after you successfully pair your device. Please check out the entire series of YouTube videos we've created to help you troubleshoot any problems you may run into, to show you all the features of our products and apps, and we even offer pro tips for those looking to deep dive. To access all of our videos, click the link in the description below or navigate to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe if you want to be alerted when we post new content, explain new features, and launch new products.